the big question is, what have you been watching recently? Where you're, you're okay, you want to dying to ask this. <laughs> I've yeah, I've been well. It's you know, it's it's a uh, Halloween. It you know, I mean, it's, it's not Halloween. It's not the day of Halloween, it's but it's but it's the ready. season. Yes. And uh, we had already decorated for Halloween in September, uh, which should. gave me license to immediately start uh, uh, watching more horror movies. <laughs> um, but also, I had been for for years. I had been wanting to. Um, share the the hellboy movies with my son oh, wow. and uh so i finally got to do that we watched the the first two hellboy movies i had forgotten that the first hellboy movie is a halloween movie actually it takes it place is. uh you know in, in the beginning on halloween so um so that was perfect uh i finally got a chance to see uh the ritual uh, and i'm yes. trying to remember but do you... oh god it was so it was so it's good so it's good it's so good it's it's, it's it's really my kind of my kind yeah, of movie same same. And if you, um, if you like people... the ritual, then uh, yeah. they made another one that's very similar to it. And really? it's not going to come to me what the title is, but I will find it. But go on, go on, go on. I will find okay, it. Okay, good. It. Um, and people have been telling me, you know, that I that I love that movie and they were right. <laughs> um, there's a lot of stuff I'm I'm missing. I missed last night uh, because we had uh, concerts to go or we had tickets to go see Pink in concert. Yes. And you don't oh you God. don't not do that. No, yeah. Um, and it was and, and Pat Benatar and uh, like, I mean, it was, uh, but yeah, it was, the show was amazing, but we had had those tickets for, since last Christmas, it was like a Christmas gift right? Um, to ourselves. And, uh, but of course my friend Joe Lynch's new film, Suitable Flesh was screening last night at Beyond Fest. And obviously we had these pink tickets and I, and I couldn't uh, go, but I, I cannot wait to see Joe's film. And it's, it's going to be perfect for, um, for, for the season as well but I'm, I'm i'm very much looking forward to that uh i i've been watching a lot of tv uh Ooh, tell me tell me tell me right i know well there's there's so much good stuff out there these days sure. so many um things. Uh, i mean hulu you know i'm not i'm not paid by hulu or anything but hulu's <laughs> been killing it uh, after i finished you know the bear we got back to only murders in the building which is just a, a delight mm. and reservation dogs is so oh, really so got to get on that one because every time it's I look so at it, I'm like, good. I think I'd really like that show. And I just, I, my, I, yeah. my docket is so full with stuff at the moment, stuff right? I probably could put to the side, but like, I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm because but I'm did, in like the mindset. Did you watch of it. the movie? That's the, that's the big question. Wait, the, you know the, the, the movie? movie, the movie Reservation Dogs? Yeah, I'm asking Katie because I'm. Oh no, she's I haven't not... seen. Oh, oh my I god, think... you have to start with that. Well, well, I, I didn't know there was a movie. Um. <gasps> What? Are you are you thinking Reservoir Dogs or Reservation Dogs? There's a because, there's a hold on. Okay, because because Reservoir Dogs it was a, a fundamentally life changing film for me, um, and I'm, you know I'm sure that's what they're pulling from with uh, with Reservation Dogs, um, just as far as that. I mean, you can even see it in the show a little bit. Not that it's anything like Reservoir Dogs. Uh, yeah, no, Reservoir Dogs is one of my favorite movies. The uh, uh, such a good movie. The internet okay. is not telling me anything about a Reservation Dogs movie. I might be. Yeah. Okay. Them up. So now there's Reservation <laughs> Blues, which I believe they made into a film. They, yes. Um, that's a Sherman Alexie. Reservation Blues is a Sherman Alexie. Uh, Sherman Alexie was a genius. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Uh, writer and you know the, his films have been amazing too. I'm mixing them up. Oh. Don't worry. About me. <laughs> oh, that's okay. okay. That's okay. <laughs> I'm just I'm just glad every now and then when I get to stump you, um, because <laughs> it's so it's so rare. Uh, so yeah, I've been uh. I've been, you know, catching up on that. I, I was, uh, I was getting back to uh, finishing the Twelve Monkeys TV show. Yeah, I gotta um, do that at some point. I never finished yeah. it. I got like yeah. mid season three or something like that. Yeah, it was, <laughs> it was. I, yeah, I was, I was in season two, and then I, I finally got back to it. Um, and it's, it's so great. It's um, but, but yeah, I mean, I, I'm looking forward to, uh, seeing the creator. I really want to get in the theater Please. and see yes. that. Yes, it's so beautiful. Um, I mean, you know, you know me. I mean, me, I'm mostly a you know a genre guy. So, like anything, That's why your best is. exactly, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> um, but there's yeah, there's so much out there, and I've I've while I watch a lot of horror movies just in general, I, you know, I, I definitely use October as an excuse to to pile okay. on you more and more. So I've got them, I've got them queued up in my on my Shutter app, and yeah, it's uh, I found it for you. So okay, yes. Uh, the one that is extremely similar to the ritual is no one gets out alive it's on netflix it's a netflix original as well so 100 okay. percent recommended uh I'm adding it to my queue as we speak yes, please please <laughs> uh also um, 
Also, I keep I hold that thought just because yes. I don't want to. I don't want you to think that I didn't notice your eyeshadow. <laughs> Thank you. I prepared. <laughs> I, I, oh, and Lupin. And Lupin just, I just opened up my Netflix thing and the new season yes. of Lupin, I think just came out today. I think so, yeah. I haven't checked Sorry. it yet. Bye, so. guys. Sorry, Paul. Bye. No more interviews. Bye. Bye. I'm going to watch Lupin. <laughs> That Omar C is so good in it everything. French takeaway from us again. Yeah. <laughs> so good. Right. Um, the French. They ruined our they were the French ruined our Omar C, you ruined our interview. Uh, uh, no one gets out alive. No one gets out alive. And then uh because you didn't mention it, so I have to tell you that you must watch No One Will Save You. I was wondering when you were gonna look that one up. <laughs> now, immediately, like it's look. It's so perfect, especially if you like sci-fi horror. It's yeah. just beautifully done. There's it's it's a tiny bit of a spoiler, but not a big one because they keep talking about it. Yeah. There's no dialogue in it at all. Nothing. Like there's I think there's only four words uh, spoken in the entire thing. So it's I'm telling you, Yuri, when I watched this movie, I was terrified and it's very hard to scare me at this point because i watched so many horror movies yeah yeah oh i love it i love <laughs> but it. i was i was literally there's one scene in it i'm not gonna spoil it don't worry mm -hmm. there's one scene in it when i was like grabbing onto my pillow and i was like fucking turn around turn the fuck around <laughs> i was <laughs> that was like me watching uh wreck remember the original yes. wreck yep yeah, yeah uh i i made the mistake of watching that uh, alone in my office with all the lights off late at night one oh. night and I mean it's it's so great but that 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 final oh, scene is so terrifying mm -hmm. um what's I gonna say I don't know I don't know I just love <laughs> I love October because it forces me usually I'm like oh I'm tired or you know I've got interviews the next morning or whatever uh <laughs> but I'm going to see pink anyway uh and drink my ties but but uh, you know you now I'm like I'm like it's October I have to you know be watching more movies and shudder is it's so good is is great for that it's, it's so good. great it's just but no one will save you is a must like if you watch anything new horror that's it's 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 you have oh to. and oh and uh, so 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 that so no one gets out alive but also no one will save you yeah is is uh, is on on hulu i think it's it's next it on my is, list yeah it's, it is on hulu it is, it is yeah it is. yeah that's that that was that was already in my queue oh, good. um watch, watch yeah it. no i'm yeah i I mean, and and that uh, that director is also terrific. Oh yeah. Um, okay. It's, oh my it's, god. So it's yeah. Okay, I've got it's so a double good. feature for tonight. <laughs> oh yeah. Thanks. Uh, Talk to me was really good as well. It wasn't what I expected, but it was it was very good. And and I finally got. Oh to yeah. See talk the... to me. Talk to me. I did see. I saw it. In, I saw yeah. it in the theater. What yeah. What did you think? Um, I you know, on one hand, I I loved it. It, it there wasn't uh. There wasn't a lot of stuff that I hadn't seen before in it in one sure. way or another, I'd except that for that. I mean, one of the things that really locked me into it that I, that I loved was the the montage, the, like the party scene when yes. you've already sort of established what's happening and they're all just getting high, just getting, you know, on like I had never like that was that was an amazing scene. And yeah. and I, I, I love that about it. Um, but it was it was it was one of the first sort of horror movies I you know gotten back into recently to see in the in theaters. Yeah. Um, but uh, yeah, it was that was that was super awesome. It it was like... good. It was more of a psychological one than yeah. than what I expected from it because I was like, yeah. oh, it's it's gonna be just you know a demon thing and that's it. Yeah. No. Yeah. <laughs> right. No, it's more than that. Uh... Right. And and I'm and I'm, I'm sort of over Ouija boards. Not sorry, Ouija board that's in my office. I, I, I didn't actually. <laughs> <remember>. Um. <laughs> But, don't uh, test but it. I, yeah, it's, it's like, right. I probably shouldn't say something like that. Don't, don't, don't um, it. But it's, uh, I mean, you know, it was, it was a different sort of take on that whole. Thing. Oh, yeah. Yeah. 100%. It's just so well trodden that I love so much. It, especially the beginning. I was literally like, I was watching it, eating my, what was I eating? I don't even know, snack or whatever. And then the moment happens and I was like, yeah. Yeah. I know. I know. What the fuck happened? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah. Yeah, you could tell they sold the movie on that. They're like, okay, yeah, you can make that movie. Yeah, I've gone in like such a different direction. Obviously, but I mean, obviously, I don't watch as many, nearly as many horror movies, or really any. Um, like, in the past, like, but like, so I, I, we movies... don't mean to shut you out when we start no, no, talking. Yeah, about yeah, movies. Sorry, I was just like sorry. the last couple of movies I saw in the cinema. I went and saw um because I hadn't seen it before. My local cinema was showing Eternal Sunshine, Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless Mind, 
um oh, so good which and i i loved it by the way because it was like you oh. will probably really love this movie i'm yeah. like yes yeah. no i did absolutely it's such a i um i haven't watched enough charlie kaufman um stuff and i really need to get into doing that because i love surrealist cinema <laughs> i like yeah. things that like to be really weird um do, and play do, have with you seen have you seen well. synecdoche in new york i haven't but it's one of those ones that like cinefix mentions a lot in, in their like movie lists and, and like almost- this- You've got, you've got to see mm-hmm. it. It's yes. yeah, yeah. So amazing. Yeah. But it was like yeah. that one, and then I think the one I did before that was Past Lives, which we mentioned it a couple of episodes ago. And yeah. it's, I it's, seen that. oh, it's so, it's so beautiful. It's like it's this pair of childhood friends who used to live together in a Korea, and then one of them emigrated to New York, um, or to um, I think Canada, uh, and then they reconnect many years later, and the, the whole movie's about like what their relationship could have been and like yeah. you know what they mean to each other but also she's got this like whole life with a husband and and all this sort of stuff and it does a really good job of not falling into any of the sort of trophy stuff that you get around the sort of like mm-hmm. um this was my childhood sweetheart sort of thing it really right. is so mature about the whole thing there's no like expectations but there's a lot of heartbreak and like yeah. i mm-hmm. just i thought it was so stunning um and i was kind of sitting there like oh, this is really emotional and like beautiful and i'm not but i'm not really like feeling particularly moved by it but there's like a shot right near the end of the movie um where that just like something happened and i was just like oh that that's where it gets me okay cool yeah you just you just reminded me in a weird way that uh, old boy was back in theaters briefly oh, wow. and i missed seeing it in the theater <gasps> no. which would have been Although I don't know that I could watch that octopus scene again. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Although here's here's a fun little tidbit because because I just brought it up. Um, if you watch the dub, and I'm not suggesting that you have to, you know, watch the English dub of uh, the American dub of of that film, but uh, once you've watched the film, go back and uh, watch the, the 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 hammer fight scene down the corridor. Yeah. Um, with the dub on, um, because uh, I worked on the dub, <gasps> and we got to that scene. And I ended up having to play most of the guys that he, you know, fucking hits in the face with That's a hammer. Now watching it with the um, dog, so yeah. You yeah, can sort of yeah, hear me yeah. being different guys getting their okay. their you know teeth knocked out. You convinced me. I don't like dubs, especially in my Korean movies and, and TV. But now I'm, I'm going to do it. <laughs> now you have to. Yeah, I have no, to. You don't have to. You know. But but uh, of course I have to. Uh, but uh, another important question popped into mind because I suggested a movie for you, and I want to know if you watched it or not. What was it? What was it you suggested? It's Korean. It's my favorite zombie movie ever. Train to Busan. Was, was it Train to Busan? I still yeah. have not seen. You know what? Train to what? Busan is one of those movies that because it's been on my list for so long and because like I get blind to <laughs> it when I go down. It's part of the down, furniture. Like, yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's part of the furniture. Um but I'm going to I'm going to add because Do I have to send you a copy of the Blu-ray as well <laughs> because that's no, because what I did with Katie. Here, I'm going to let me see let me see if I if I pull this up if it's uh um oh uh I also wanted to see because uh, on on Shutter. Oh, great! They just had got VHS eighty five, which I want to see. Nice. Um, but um, the the angry black girl and her monster. I've been waiting yes. to see. Yes, yes, yes. Um, I really want to see that. Um, but on my list, let's see. I think it's still. God, there's so many things on my list. I mean, that's. <laughs> if it's not on, even on the list, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> just so you know. <laughs> no, I know, but but I think because I think they still have it on on Shutter. Uh, but I may be wrong. Be I may have that. it on a different. It might be on on Hulu or something. Hulu actually has really good uh, horror. They have a really good yes. horror. Yeah, it's not on. Uh, there's a. Um, it's not called Birth. It's not. Uh, there's a really good. Let me see if I've still got it on my list. This is this is just a podcast about uh, Yuri going through his uh, movie yeah. cues. Um, but in it, I I saw it. Uh, let's see, I've got no no. Um. What is it? Because I think I left it on my list just because. Oh, hatching. Hatching, yes. Yep. Hatching was yep. so good. And I saw the trailer scary for this in a, way a that while I was not ago. Expecting. Um, and I remember thinking it looked very interesting. <laughs> yeah, it is. Add that back to your list if you have it. It's a good, uh, good Halloween movie. Yeah. So good. So See, good. This, the, I think, the creature the, uh... work in that is awesome, and I was not expecting it. I think this did the the um um the movie um uh, what's it called the I can't think of the word right now um the the festival film festival circuit I think that's where I, I heard about it um when it when, yeah. when it was coming out yeah we're 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 right in the middle of Beyond Fest which is my favorite uh, film festival yeah. in Los Angeles it's sort of a companion to Fantastic Fest and um 
and I was unable to get tickets except anything except the Wicker Man. I'm going to see a Wicker Man with a with, with a friend. Cage. The, the, no, the original one, not the, original the bees. One. bees one. Okay. Uh, they're both delightful. Not the bees. Yeah, yeah, they not are the bees. Delightful. Uh, but yeah, full core. I mean, talking about ritual and full core. I mean, it's sort of perfect to. Um, I've just noted. I'm sure. I'm sure Paul's about to come in and chastise me. I'm. Uh, we're. I've got to. I've got to get to another. And I. And I already don't want to talk to them. Because <laughs> um, I want to keep hanging out with you guys and talk about oh, movies. Man. Yes. Uh, but oh. but you know, well, again, David Blue. This again. David he Blue. also loves movies. So I know I'm so excited. I'm so yeah. excited. Um, okay. B- before before we let you go, I yes. <laughs> I want to share something with both of you because Katie doesn't know and you don't know either. And I'm, I'm, I've been <laughs> I've been holding it in because I don't want to jinx it because I jinx things like this before. But uh, I'm going to have my first exhibition next year from my drawings. <laughs> what? Lily, yeah. that's amazing. <laughs> where, where are you going? I imagine in Hungary. Yes. <laughs> yeah. It's Damn it. I was hoping you would say you would say in Los Angeles. Um, <laughs> oh my God, you deserve that so much. It be incredible. Oh my God. <laughs> Thank you. I'm like, I, I wish you could all just come and be there with me. But like, you know. Oh my God, when is I, when is it? And how how long is it going to be going uh, on? It's going to be in February. Uh, the, the opening is going to be, I think, at the end of February, and it's going to be throughout the entire of, of March. Oh, we go. Congratulations. Hey. That's awesome. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so hey. now everyone knows, and I hope I didn't jinx it because it's still. No, good. no, you no. will you will not jinx it. And I expect uh, like photos and videos yes. and, and everything. Yes, yes, yes. yes. It's, it's going to come. I'm, I promise. <laughs> so, yeah, that's the happy news I wanted to share. <laughs> Yay. Congratulations. Um, Thank you. Hopefully, I, at one point, maybe I will end up in Los, Los Angeles. In right. Maybe if it goes well, they'll want to do it elsewhere. Maybe. Oh, God. Uh, I was trying maybe. to touch wood and I smacked something. <laughs> <laughs> Don't hurt So yourself. excited. You started breaking things, Katie. <laughs> Whoa. Flipping table. <laughs> All right. All right. Um, Yuri, we're going to let you go. Um, and yeah. It's, it's, As it's... usual, I've loved hanging out with you guys. Thank you. And uh, watch, you know, movies. watch movies. Watch movies. <laughs> watch movies. <laughs> I'll talk to you guys soon. Thank you so much. Bye, Yuri. Bye.